Hello everyone. Today we are going to see how to push the Android code to GitHub from Android Studio. In this tutorial, we are going to see how to connect GitHub to our Android Studio, how to create repository in GitHub and we will also see how to push the Android code to GitHub from Android Studio. So, watch the tutorial till end. And if you like our tutorial, don't forget to subscribe our channel and if you want the tech knowledge every day then follow us on blogger link is given in the description box so let's begin first we will see how we can connect our github account to android studio so logging to your github account and here we can find the setting button so in the setting menu scroll down and here we will find developer setting click on it here we have to select personal access token now Click here to generate the new token. Here we have to give the token name. I will write as my PC. Now select all this checkbox. By checking this checkbox, we are allowing to all the operation to this token and click on this generate token button. So our token is generated. Simply copy this token. Now let's move to our Android Studio and see how we can connect GitHub account to Android Studio. Here I have created one demo project to see how we can push the code to GitHub. First let's see how we will connect our account. So go to the setting and here you can find version control. In the version control we can get GitHub and click on this plus button. Now this will ask that how we will log in to our github we will select with the token here we have to enter our token and simply click on the add account so here we can see our account is added now simply click on the ok button now let's see how we will create the repository in github so here click on this plus button and here we can find new repository now here we have to give the repository name. I will set the name as demo. Now we can also write the description of this project. As of now I will write as demo. Now here we can find two options. If we select public then this repository is visible by all other. And if we select private then this repository will only seen by you. So I will select public and click on this create repository button so here we can see our repository is created now simply copy this link and let's move to android studio and see how we will push this code to the github now here first we have to enable github for this project so click here and click on this enable version control button here this will ask for the version control system we will select git and simply click on the ok button so here we can see we have enabled version control system now simply change the view from android to project view and here we will see how we can push this code to our github so simply click on this github menu and here you can find manage remotes click on it now by this plus sign we can add the remotes so simply click on this plus button and paste our URL and click on the OK button. So we can see our repository is added. Now let's see how we will push this code to our GitHub server. So right click on this project and in the git option click on the add button. To upload all the files first we need to add the files. After that we have to commit this file. So go to the git option and click on the commit directory button. Now here we can see these files. Simply write the comment like demo project and click on this commit button. So our code is now committed. Now let's see how we will push this code to the server. So go to the github option and click on this push button and simply click on this push button. So this will push the code to the github server. Now this will asking that from which account you want to push this code. I have multiple accounts so in my case I will select 
this account and click on this login button. So we can see our branch is pushed to the server. Now let's see our code. Simply go to the browser and refresh the page. So here we can see our code is pushed. If you want to learn GitHub from the scratch then comment below. I will make the tutorial on it. Hope you guys understand this tutorial. Thank you guys for watching this video. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Stay tuned.